Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. I finally got my very first influencer box and I was so happy and so excited about it that I forgot to film the unboxing. But my life has been so incredibly hectic that I just, I have so many back to videos and so many things I have to do that it's just overwhelming. But let me just get the unboxing and tell you guys what I got. The box that Influencer sent me is the Fiesta box and it is so cute. It's really festive with little streamers and runes and stuff. I was able to get everything back in the box because I had already laid it out and everything. The only thing that I don't have in here is my Premier Protein Bar because I was so excited when I got it that I couldn't wait and I totally forgot about the video and everything and I just gulped it down before and after my workout and then I was like, oh my jeez, but never fear, I will post up a picture here somewhere in the video so you can see what that looks like. Anyways, let me get to the products that I got. So some of the products that came in here, let me start with the Suave Smoothing um, Lotion with Cocoa Butter. I really like this lotion. I like that when you apply it on your skin, it like soaks in really quick. It's not like on there and it's not greasy or anything like that. It just sinks in and then afterwards your skin feels really moisturized. Well, at least mine does. It feels really moisturized and I love it. And the scent, it's got a really nice scent. This one's a shea butter scent and it, it, it has a really strong scent and it just lasts all day. So I like it. I like putting this um, on my skin after the shower or I even squeeze some out on an empty little uh, lotion lotion container and I carry it around with me in my purse because I'm always washing my hands and they just get so dry and crackly that it's ridiculous. So I'm really, I really like and I'm enjoying this suave lotion. Another thing I got is Not Your Mother's Beach Babe Moisturizing Shampoo and the Moisturizing Conditioner. I have not used these yet as of the time that I'm filming this video, but um, but I did open them up and they smell like, like a tropical beachy summer day or something like that. I don't know. They smell like coconut and I can't wait to try these out because they smell like pure tropicalness. <laughs> like pure tropicalness. I can't wait to slather these all up in my hair. Next is I got the NYC uh, Smooth Skin Bronzer. Um, this is a little, little dark for me, but still I like dark, dark bronzers anyways because I'm kind of colorless. So if I can get something that's going to give me color to the skin, I'll use it. So I've tried this on and it's really nice. It's really smooth and buttery. I like, oh, I have shampoo on my finger. It's really smooth and buttery and I, I like it. It just, it stays on my skin all day and I have no issues with it. I'm really liking it. I can't wait to use it a lot more. This, uh, the one that I got is in 728 and uh, is a smooth skin bronzing face powder by NYC Cosmetics. Another thing I can't wait to try is the number seven night cream. Um, I've been using the philosophy cream and I like it, but I wanna find other alternatives for when that runs out. I can try over other stuff and not just get my skin accustomed to one product and then it just stops working. So um, this is a night cream and it's for normal. It's for normal to dry skin and I have oily combination skin so I don't know exactly how this will work out for me but I'm gonna try it and I guess I'll find out. A healthful bread uh, little card that explains um, what healthful bread is and it says it's 80 calories per slice, 100% whole grain, no artificial colors, flavors, or preservatives and it's priced out at 3 99 so I'm definitely gonna check that out because I love 
in the mornings before my workout eating some toast uh, with peanut butter and then after my workout some toast and avocado or something like that so if this is going to be really really help helpful for me more than just the regular 100 percent whole bread then i'm definitely excited to give this a try free daisy squeeze sour cream that's awesome i love sour cream i love sour cream on my chicken or if i'm making like some those uh, taco salads or whatever i like using sour cream on there or on tostadas or chalupas or whatever i mean there's always a use for sour, sour cream so um i definitely want to try this i've already tried it i just haven't tried the the squeeze the little squeeze packaging but i do like daisy sour cream and of course if i can make sour cream and onion dip oh my god i'll take it so free uh daisy sour cream in here here's a five dollar voucher for the healthful bread products so now i'm really gonna run out and buy them since i have the five dollar gift card or gift coupon voucher whatever it is so um that was in there too and oh, i think my favorite out of everything is the you get a free onion bloom from outback steakhouse i love that place I have to admit, I've never had their onion blooms, but now that I have my free onion bloom here, I'm definitely gonna go and try it. Not that I've never wanted to try it, it's just that I avoid it because I know it's fried and breaded and whatever, battered, so I kind of just stay away from that and stay away from entrees, but uh, I think this can be just fried on a cheat day, so I'm gonna go try that out very very soon and last thing is here it, last thing in here is a two dollar off boots number seven skincare uh so any beautiful skin facial care item and it's for target so next time i'm in target i will look for more nyc stuff and also for the number seven skincare so i can kind of try out different products maybe eye creams or toners or whatever it is they have this will definitely help me out um, and it's for two dollars off so the last thing that I was missing was my protein bar and like I said I already tried the protein bar and I liked it it was yogurt and peanut butter it has 30 grams of protein and 3 grams of fiber and it is pretty big it is fairly big so what I did is I I halved it and I took half a uh, pre-workout before my workout and half after my workout so I thought it was it tasted really good. It didn't taste nasty. It does have that kind of protein barish kind of feel, like kind of gritty, sort of. But uh, the yogurt part tastes really good, and I really, I did enjoy it. I'm not even gonna say I didn't like it, and or anything like that. I did enjoy it. I liked it. It did keep me full. I didn't get hungry. So I'm thinking I want to purchase those maybe in different flavors just to try them out because they are convenient to have carrying around in my purse because sometimes you don't have time to eat and I do not like, I hate and despise any fast food bre breakfast, any bagels or uh, biscuit sandwiches or anything like that that you can get like from a drive through restaurant. I don't like them. So I'd rather carry around my protein bar and know that I'm getting at least some nutrition out of it or good nutrition um, out of it and just like be good throughout the day. I don't have to worry about saturated fats or trans fats or anything like that disgusting that I already put in my body. I don't need it for breakfast. So um, I am excited to try, uh, to try more of the flavors out because I think they work really good for me. So I can't even complain. So that was it. Those were all my products that I got in my first influencer box, which was the Fiesta box. So I can't wait to get more and hopefully I can post this up, up really soon because I hate being irresponsible and not getting things done. But unfortunately, like I said, I have so much going on right now that it's just nearly impossible for me to sit down and edit a video because I will film them, but then just to edit them takes so much time and I just can't get them up on time but the time is now is it the time is now so i hope you guys enjoyed this video and i'll see you in my next one bye